Are you looking for the best motorcycle dash cams? In this video, we will look at some of the six best dash cams on the market. Before we get started with our video, we have included links in the description. So make sure you check those out to see which one is in your budget range. Starting at number 1. Kenwood STZ-RF 200WD. The Kenwood STZ-RF 200WD is a two-channel system that is designed to be discreetly mounted to motorcycles, scooters, and other ATVs. It uses front and rear minicams that connect to a control box and has a remote trigger for entering manual recording mode. The front and rear camera both capture video in 1920x 1080p resolution at 27.5 frames per second that offers a crisp video with accurate capture of fine details, like license plate numbers. Both cameras record super-wide images that measure at a 195-degree angle. This is a much wider angle than most cameras and is ideal for capturing action on the far periphery of view. It will induce a small amount of fishbowl effect, however when we examined video taken by the camera, the edges of the image looked surprisingly good. The front and rear camera connect to a control box that is intended to mount beneath the seat. A control wire routes to the handlebars for triggering manual recordings. The control box also connects to an included GPS antenna for adding location data to recordings and a G-sensor for triggering event recordings on impact. The cameras, trigger, and GPS antenna all carry an IP66-67 rating to prevent dust and moisture damage. They will withstand gentle washing, rain, fog, and dust storms. The main control unit is rated at IP55, so it isn't as well protected, but will withstand some dust and moisture. Video files are stored on a micro SD card. Kenwood includes a 32 MB card and the system can handle up to a 256 MB card, which is highly recommended. At number 2. Inov K5. One of the things that we've learned using dash cams in cars is that the higher the quality of the video, the more useful it is when identifying key details is vital, such as when an accident happens. The Inov K5 is one of the latest systems to hit the market and features industry-leading 4K resolution. The camera records at 30 frames per second for smooth video playback. The rear camera captures video at 1080p. Both front and rear cameras capture at a 120-degree diagonal angle which maximizes detail capture at the expense of peripheral images. The cameras connect to a central control unit and includes a remote trigger and a GPS antenna. All the components received an IP67 rating to prevent damage from dust, dirt, and water. It'll withstand washing and off-road riding with ease. Dual-band Wi-Fi allows for users to easily download videos to a smartphone for review and provides access to a number of interesting features. The cameras record in time-lapse, impact, and manual recording. A built-in G-sensor provides impact detection recording. One of the unique features with this system is also one of our favorites with automotive camera systems, parking mode. The camera goes into sleep mode when the bike is turned off but will automatically start recording if an impact is detected, giving you access to images even when you aren't riding. The system records videos to a micro SD card. The control box can handle up to a 515 MB card, providing you with days of recordings even though the 4K files are massive. No card is included with the package, so plan ahead and buy the largest, highest quality card you can. At number 3. Rexing MTC-1. This camera surprised us with the range of features and functions it has at the price point. It is a two-channel design that captures a wide 170-degree front and rear angle, which is a decent compromise between fine detail and a wide view. Both front and rear cameras use a 2MP sensor to capture 1080p resolution at 30 frames per second. Both cameras are miniature designs that are easy to find mounting locations for, however we don't care for the mounts themselves. They lack the ability to rotate, making it essential to get the perfect alignment when installing or the camera will not capture straight. The camera is wired to a central controller that also includes a small IPS touchscreen for watching videos directly. Built-in Wi-Fi allows the device to send content to your smartphone for more convenient viewing. The Rexing system also includes a built-in GPS logger and can capture video in parking mode, a feature usually seen on more costly options. 
The images are stored to a micro SD card up to 128 GB and will loop record, overwriting non-protected videos. A G sensor will automatically save videos that are triggered by an impact. One of our favorite things about this camera is the focus on enhancing image quality at night. Many systems don't do well in low light, but the Rexing MTC-1 does a superb job of enhancing the image for better viewability. It even captures high-quality images in parking mode. The entire system received an IP67 rating that means it'll withstand dust and dirt along with low-pressure sprays of water. You won't have to worry about it failing in the rain or when you are cleaning your bike. At Number 4. Thinkware M1. Thinkware makes some of our favorite dash cams for cars and we were excited to check out the M1 to see how the features measure up. This is a system that blurs the line between action camera and dash cam with unique features and some of the best image stabilization tech we've seen. Both front and rear cameras capture video at a 1080p resolution with a 30 frames per second rate. The camera's 170-degree viewing angle does an excellent job of capturing details and providing a broad field of view. When we looked at video files, we were surprised by the level of detail and quality of the images, even when compared to higher-priced options. The camera equipment has an IP66 rating to prevent dust, dirt, and water from damaging the camera. The rating makes it a good choice for dirt bikes, cruisers, and everything in between. Even the design has a cool, tough look with threaded cases that make it look rugged. The cameras connect to a central command unit and a trigger lets you manually record with the press of a button. It has built-in GPS, the G-sensor, and Wi-Fi to make viewing the video files fast and simple. Video files are loop recorded on a micro SD card except for manual and event triggered videos. We mentioned the image stabilization earlier, but we think this is really one of the features that sets this camera apart from other designs. It does a remarkable job when you are riding on rough roads, off-road, or fording streams on your bike or ATV. Super Night Vision gives the M1 some of the most impressive low-light conditions of any camera we've examined. At Number 5. Sena 10C Pro. The Sena 10C Pro is the industry standard for motorcycle helmet cams with built-in communication capabilities. The 10C features a 2K front-facing camera with a controller built into the unit. The unit then attaches to your favorite helmet and you're good to go. It's rechargeable, so no wiring is required. The front cam has a variety of settings for resolution to increase clarity or smoothness. At the top, it records in 1440p at 30 frames per second. By dropping resolution to 1080p, the camera can capture at 60fps for smooth video. Adding communications capabilities unlocks more fun on group rides and helps make for a safer journey when you can communicate with fellow riders. The 10C Pro can connect up to four units simultaneously. The communication system can connect to your smartphone using Bluetooth for hands-free calling with advanced noise cancellation and HD voice for clear calls over the sound of your engine. This camera has a time-lapse mode you can set to record every 1 second or 10 seconds. Limitations of this camera include the lack of impact detection and GPS logging data. The trade-off is that this camera works with any helmet, anytime, making it incredibly versatile. At Number 6. LKT DB1 Pro. This design is more appropriate for lower speed motorsports, but it will work even on a high performance sports bike to provide both a front and rear image. The cameras have a 1080p resolution. The rear cam has a built in 15 degree angle to provide clear images of license plates. This system uses a Sony MX307 sensor that does a good job capturing low light images along with details in bright light. It is IP65 rated to provide you with good protection against the elements. Built-in Wi-Fi makes sharing and viewing video files quick and simple. Video files are time-lapse recorded or continuous and are stored onto a micro SD card. The camera can handle a maximum of a 128 GB card. We like the simplicity of this design. The mount uses any standard GoPro mount so it is easy to hook to any helmet, and it provides a surprisingly good image even when riding on bumpy roads. This is a great option for mountain bikes, snowmobiles, and scooters.